yeah, my family is really, really rich. We have our own beach house on our own private island, and Daddy always uses his yacht to take us there for vacation. Whoa, that's so cool, Calypso. Man, I wish my family was that rich. Oh, you can only wish to be half as rich as me. And it's all thanks to Daddy's popsicle sticks. Popsicle sticks? Are you kidding me? That's what made you guys rich? Well, you'd be surprised how much money could make off of something as small as popsicle sticks. So much so that Daddy could buy me anything I want when I asked. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm not buying this bowl for a second. Alyssa! What? How could you say that? What Calypso is saying is obviously true. Right, okay. Is that right? So if it's all so true, then Calypso, can we see some pictures of the beach house? Or Daddy's yacht? Sorry, but with it being a private island and all, I'm not allowed to show pictures of the house. Isn't it your own private island though? You should be able to do whatever you want on your own island. Even take some pictures. Bye. Here's a picture of me on the beach last summer. Mm-hmm. That wasn't from last summer. That was from before freshman year. We were in Miami. I was the one that took that photo. Calypso, have you been lying this whole time? What the no? It, it's all legit. The beach house, the island, the yacht, everything. Just like being able to get whatever you want, whenever you I want. I can't. Then prove it. I don't have to prove anything to you. And just that argument alone shows that you have nothing to use to prove your claim. Yet you're still going to go around here telling these lies just to gain attention and popularity. But knowing that I don't believe you will continue to nag at the back of your brain because you do, in fact, care about what other people think of you. So if you don't want my voice bugging you in the back of your brain, then you're going to have to prove it. What did you have in mind? You're going to have to come in bearing three name brand items. A Gucci belt, a Louis Vuitton bag, and a Balenciaga jacket. <laughs> Is that it? Easy. And they have to match as an outfit. Not a problem. And they have to be authentic. The real thing. You have until Friday. Friday? Well, I thought next Friday would give you way too much time, and to have it in by tomorrow would be too soon, but if you think you could have it in by tomorrow... No! No! I will have it in by then. You'll see. Thanks for bringing it in. I don't know, it would be real embarrassing if she didn't. I doubt that she will. Maybe she'll surprise us, or maybe she won't. Either way, somebody needs to call her out on her lies. Hey, have you seen Calypso today? No, she didn't come into home room today. I heard she was out sick. I wouldn't worry though. I bet her dad's got a private tutor that will catch her up on everything she missed today. You really shouldn't believe everything she tells you. Some people like to embellish their life stories just to get attention. Yeah, but I'm sure some of the stuff she says is true. Right? Some things, yes. But you'd be surprised with how short that list runs nowadays. I just hope she comes to realize soon that she doesn't need to tell all those stories just to have friends that will stand behind her. <sighs> okay, let's check out the bags. Oh, oh, jeez! Oh, they're so close! You can hardly even tell the difference. And they have to be authentic, the real thing. How am I gonna pull this off?
well, it's the end of the day and you still have yet to bring in the spread and you have two days left to do so. Yes, I know, I get it, Alyssa, but don't worry. And I haven't brought it in yet because I found the jacket and the belt, but I just couldn't find the specific bag I was looking for in my entire collection. So you mean to tell me that you have a whole spread of Louis Vuitton in your wardrobe? Oh, honey. I have a spread of all three brands in my wardrobe. Then how come we haven't seen it? Well, I just didn't want to flaunt. Besides, you said you wanted to see all of it at once. So I'll bring it in on Friday as soon as I find that belt. I thought you were missing the bag. Yes. And I'm missing the belt. See, I have a very specific look that I'm going for. Uh-huh, okay, well, call me when you get your story straight. I'll see y'all later. Call me when you get your story Is this really worth it? I'm spending my entire savings on this. Well, call me when you get your story straight. Then again, anything is better than hearing Alyssa's nagging. Uh-oh, Thursday morning and she still has nothing. You know, I'm really just starting to think she was telling a bunch of lies. She was telling a bunch of lies, Faye. But she has a chance to turn this around if she admits that she has been. Come tomorrow morning, if she comes in empty-handed again, then that'll just prove that she isn't rich, but instead just an attention seeker. If she were to just come out about it, it would at least save her the embarrassment of being exposed. It hurts to think that she's been lying to us, but we'd still be her friends. Mm -hmm. Why doesn't she realize that? Some people do things to make up for what they either don't or didn't have in the past. For her, she's trying to make up for her lack of attention at home. What do you mean? She's the oldest of five. And they're all at least seven years younger than her. They need more attention from their mother than she would because she'd be seen as more mature as she is the oldest. Her father is actually not in the picture. What? It was a messy divorce. He's a drunken deadbeat anyway, so she got custody of the kids. He's not rich, far from it actually. He lives in a trailer park, surrounded by bottles and cans. Meanwhile, while she's running around, distracted by the younger kids' antics, she still tries to give her the attention that she needs. But there's only so much that a single mother can do in the middle of class. How do you know all this? I've known Calypso since we were in the eighth grade. She's been doing it for years. Since then, I was one of the few people that got to see what it is that she goes through. I've seen where her mom works herself to the bone. She sees it too. Hey, she acknowledged it. but. Still just wasn't enough for her. Man, being the oldest is tough, but I never knew she went through all that. It's amazing that she's able to keep such an upbeat attitude. I would have lost my mind. Wait a minute. If you know all this, then how come you're only calling it out now? Because I felt it was time for her to realize that she doesn't need to embellish her life story just to have friends. Calypso! Hey baby, dinner's almost ready. What are those? Uh, 
why do I see a Balenciaga, a Gucci, and a Louis Vuitton? Girl, what is going on here? Mom, I... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It's all Alyssa's fault. Alyssa? But well, baby, what happened? Well, she was going around and telling all of our friends that she was so rich and she could get whatever she wanted when she wanted it. Okay. That doesn't explain why you have all these expensive items in your room. Well, well, I, I just borrowed it from her. And she told me that if I didn't take care of it, that I was going to have to suffer the consequences. And I don't even want to think about what she could do to me. Calypso. The truth. Now, I know Alyssa is better than that, and I know she would never do anything like that. You need to let me know what is happening here and why you have three name brand items in your room. Okay. It was my fault. I said some things that weren't true, and Alyssa called me out on it. Things. What kind of things did you say? Things like being rich and being able to get what I want when I wanted it. Oh, Calypso. Why would you say something like that when you know it's not true? Because it's nice knowing that some people think that you're cool. But you don't have to lie. What did she say? She said I had to prove it by wearing an authentic Balenciaga jacket, Gucci belt, and Louis Vuitton bag on Friday. Friday? That's tomorrow. Look at this stuff. This all looks like it's the real thing. How much did you pay for it? Uh, how much? Did you pay for it? $3,300. Was it worth it? Mm -hmm. I hope you realize the telling lies gets you nothing but lack of trust from your friends, your loved ones, and it gets you an empty bank account. Oh, you're getting a job. Huh. Yeah, you're getting a job, young lady. You're going to replace all the money that your grandparents gave you for college. But mom... No, 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 no. Don't butt mom me. No questions asked. Do I make myself clear? Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton, Balenciaga, Gucci, unfreaking believable, three thousand dollars. Like money goes on. Think she'll show? I don't know. I know I wouldn't if I knew I couldn't do something like that. To be honest, I almost feel bad for putting her through this challenge. But she needs to learn her lesson. Hold up, what? You know, it's not polite to stare. Oh, I don't understand. How? Well, it was simple, really. I just had to... I just had to blow through all the college savings my grandparents gave to me or when we graduate. The truth is, I'm not rich. I'm barely even middle class. My dad's not even there. My parents are divorced. I'm really sorry about all the lies I told you. It was just nice knowing that there were people who thought I was cool. But if you don't want to be my friends anymore, I completely understand. Sit down, 
We already knew. What? Alyssa told me everything yesterday. We already knew. You but then we didn't want to say anything because we didn't know if you'd even show up, let alone with the stuff. You told her about me? Why would you do that? Because she needed to understand that not everybody's going to be honest with her. Some people can be perfectly honest, while others are straight lying to her face. So she needed to realize the difference between something being true and false. I will apologize, though, for putting you through a spiral of potential embarrassment. I'll help you replace the money. Thanks, but no. Um, if anything, these are gifts for you. Can we make it up to you? You say you don't want our help replacing the money, but you're getting it anyway. There's no way we're not helping you. Besides, I doubt your mom didn't ground you for this. Yeah, for two weeks. Don't worry, girl. We'll help her replace that money in no time. Thanks, guys. Get this money back. How much are we working towards anyway? Oh yeah. How much did you spend? 